Okay, what I'd like to show you this morning again is another scenario uh, whereby uh, because a lot of times I'm noticed by the clinician and that is the baby's typically let's say on six centimeters of bubble CPAP uh, since there's high humidity going through the circuitry a lot of times there's rain out in the circuit and uh, what happens is that creates kind of a double bubble effect I call it uh, and the, the most serious thing about this situation, which happens all the time in NICUs, is it actually can affect the pressure being delivered to the baby. Uh, and sometimes it's rectified immediately, and other times it's, uh, it's not go, it goes unnoticed. The clinicians are out there doing other uh, things with other babies. And you can see from the monitor that it's almost double the, the pressure that we have set initially of six centimeters of water pressure. And this creates, in my opinion, a serious situation where you can have potential uh, lung damage to the infant. And, uh, you know, again, this would typically go unnoticed by, as far as the pressure goes, by the clinicians in the uh, NICU. But the monitor picks this up immediately, gives the clinicians a heads up that, hey, we have a high pressure situation and you need to address that immediately.